Hello guys, uh, my name is Harry and um, this is my review. So in front of me this is HP a Lightbook 850 G7. This cup, I mean this laptop comes with a with a 65 watt charger which is just right here. So this is the charger. 65 watts. Uh it gives power output for 19 volts. It gives about the current of 3.3 ampere. That's the charger. And uh, from the connecting wall socket, it looks like this one. But this cable, you can change this one because there are several types which can fit from here. And uh, from the connector, which comes to the charging port of the computer, um, it looks like uh, it looks like this one so this is the cable but also this computer you can charge this one by using usb type c if you have uh, if you have a usb type c adapter you can recharge it by using the usb type c as you can see here so for the number this computer comes with this uh, it comes with about six ports and the the first one this is usb usb port and this is a HDMI port, this is USB normal one, and this is USB Thunderbolt, and this one is here, here is for inserting a SIM card, so in case you want to access the data and other information, you can insert a SIM card here, and this is a normal charging port. From the other side here, we can have a look, it has uh, other two ports as well, so we have this one in USB Thunderbolt or for fast and we have this another one 3.5 millimeter jack for headphone uh, This is how it looks from the top and uh, this is how it looks from the back It has this It has this two rubbers for which acts as a stand And uh, to avoid scratches from the back of the computer it has just five bolts in case you want to screw and have access inside. So let us flip to the other side and let us see the specification inside how it looks, with the specs, how they are. Um, this computer, when I bought this one, um, it had about um, only eight uh, gigs of RAM. But I made an upgrade to make it to be 16. So from the exterior, this is how the keyboard looks like. The keyboard, it has this shiny aluminium finishing. And um, it supports, uh, it supports um, NFC. It supports NFC. As you can see here. Uh, for the specs, this computer, it comes with the... Core i5 number for Intel. Uh, it comes with fingerprint sensor for security purposes. And uh, for the speaker system, it comes with this um, Bang Olsfen speakers. For the keyboard, the keyboard is layout is how it looks like this one. Most of the keyboard ends here, but this one it has a number extension to you to the back or to the edges. So some of us are used to the keyboards which has just a number on top here on this row but this one it has a number on this side and uh, on this side as well so uh, let me turn it on and the button if the switch button is just right here you can just turn this one on as long as this computer runs on an ssd it boots really faster it boots very faster compared to the um, computers which runs on a hard drive and um I inserted some of my personal personal information, so I will just log in by using the fingerprint, and then we can get more information about the um, about the computer. So I just use my fingerprint. Boom, we are in. So that's how the keyboard it looks like, and um, the keyboard is massive. I mean, the screen display is massive, and the display of this one is not LCD. This is LED display. Um, so with the better specification, the better actually, I made a test 
and the battery on this computer it goes for about 11 hours for just normal use um like uh, going online doing other stuffs it lasts for about 11 hours i don't know i hope maybe the battery may be subjected to change as long as i use it but at the moment those are the specs it it has so um right now the computer is uh, running on a uh it runs on a it runs on a, it runs on a window window 11 in, in the 11 which is just the latest version uh for the storage um uh, let us have a look for the storage it has about a 255 uh, GB which runs on an SSD and for the specs uh, this machine is quite 5 number of CPU is there which goes from 1.6 gigahertz up to 2.11 gigahertz uh, for the processor this now I mean even though I mean even this computer is a core i5 uh, but uh, it's actually fast because it has uh, several number of uh, processor or number of core. Rebecca can you come and have a look here. So if you can see here, the computer has about eight cores of processor. So it's quite fast. I had another computer which was a Quai Five. I mean, which was a Quai Seven Intel. But um, it it only had about um, I think it only had a four four logical processor. I mean it it only had a four cores. So this one it has eight cores. So it runs very fast. The other thing which I come to like about this computer, when I was setting up um, this window installation, uh, actually it comes with some privacy features. You can block all the privacy feature like you are you you can prevent the computer from accessing your location, your personal data. But also, on the top here, on the display, it has this little switch. On the camera, I can see, show to you. You can see, as you see now, it is blocked here. You can open this up. As you can see now, now the camera cover is opened, and now you can close. I don't know if you can see it clearly. So that's for privacy features. You know, sometimes you can be online or using your computer, but um, website can be spying on you without your consent. But uh, this computer it comes with this feature. Uh, that's how it see. So yeah, there it goes. So you can open this one and close in case you don't need it. So if you want to use your camera as a webcam, you can just flip there. So. Those are the few features, guys. Um, so far, so good for the storage. I did, uh, I did, I did some partition so far, and this is how it looks. I this is for local disk C, whereby there is operating system, and this is just for normal storage. So that's how it looks guys and um thanks for watching i hope to see you on the next one